Hi, hi everyone, welcome to Weedon Secret. Today I have a huge announcement that is, I've been trying to do this huge announcement for quite some weeks, but what I'm doing takes a heck of a lot of practice and a heck of a lot of expensive equipment to do. So now that I've perfected it, I want to let you know soap makers, bath bomb makers, wax melt makers, cream makers, any cosmetics, fragrance makers. Um, I'm now selling on the website custom packaging boxes at very, very affordable prices. And the quality of them is excellent. You know it's been a pet peeve of mine and I know it's been a pet peeve of yours all the years we've been doing this and it suddenly dawned on me instead of hunting for yet some more packaging boxes to fit my products why don't I make them uh, that way we can get all the beautiful designs that we cannot find anywhere unless we spend like thousands of pounds on very large quantities of packaging boxes this way you can buy in small quantities and um, you're still going to get the package bo packaging box at the same kind of price that you would pay for um, a packaging box that someone had designed for you. Not only that, but they are super strong. Um, very, very simple to use. Very time saving if you need to package your products. The best thing about them, there's no plastic needed. You don't need to pre-wrap your soap. You don't need to shrink wrap your soap. You don't need to wrap it in plastic and then wrap it with ribbon. You don't even need to put it in a, a glassine bag to put in the box. You can just put it straight into the box. And I can tell you that I think any of these boxes that are on a shelf in a store are going to stand out among all the rest that are, that are out there. Now, I've had a look at, on Etsy at their prices and the prices I'm selling at are round about um, not quite half the price but very near to half the price if you were to get a box made on Etsy. I don't even know whether the quality would be as good. I don't know how thick the card is. I'm using a minimum of 300 GSM card to make my boxes because you know I like a good strong box. If you've been watching me for years, uh, you'll know that I like a good strong box that's pretty, it's the right size, is everything that we want it to be. Now we'll go over to the website later and I'll explain how this is all going to work to make it really really simple for you but I also will have on the website a custom what I'm going to call these is off the shelf designs you tell me what size you want and then I make the boxes, however many you've ordered, I make the boxes to fit your products. So the best way to do that... Okay, so I need to know what size your product is. So you're just going to get a ruler. You can do it in inches or centimetres, whatever you prefer. I'm measuring from the bottom of the bar of soap here and I can see that the top peak on my soap, it actually measures 10 centimetres, which is four inches high. So if you give me that exact measurement of the height, because that's the height, and then the width is just under six centimetres on this one, about two and a quarter, and the depth which will be however thick you cut your soaps. Most people cut it about an inch, uh, so a little bit less than an inch and a quarter. Um, 
so as long as I've got those measurements exactly right, I know how big to make your box. That's the easiest way, I think, because if you were to try and guess how far over it needs to stick on that side, how far over it needs to stick on this side, and the same on all the sides, it might be a little more difficult on getting that correct. So basically, that's all I need from you. And you would add that into the note section, add a note section on your order form. So let's have a look at some boxes, shall we? The beauty with them is they are so quick to assemble. You can see how strong they are. When they come to you, they'll just be flat packed like that and piled one on top of the other. So all you need to do is when you're packing your orders, pick your box up, pop your, pop your wax melt in, flip the lid over, press that in and that's it, it's done. Of course, if you need to add any labels, you can add the labels next. But it's going to save a heck of a lot of time. It's going to save all the plastic because it's totally plastic free, this option. And uh, what I also will be doing, this is the size box I'll be using for most of my soaps because that's the size I tend to do all my soaps at. So just take my soap and pop it in there. I can do it you know different heights the width's always the same but I, I can make them different heights depending on how high or narrow I make my soap um, and then what you can also do is this is another one in that size and this is another um, something else I'm going to offer to you at a very very good price um and that is making the labels so i'll just sell them okay so what we can do is we can i can also make the labels to go on your box um so we'll need a label for the front of the box on the front of the box you want to keep it pretty simple uh in a in a font that people can read well um and you need to say, you know, advertise your company with your logo. You need to tell them the name of the soap. You need to tell them that it is soap. I've got on here that it's made in the English Lake District because I think that's a selling point. I've got the fragrances that are in the soap and then I've got the weight on the front. So that tells the customer what uh, is in the box. And then on the back, you'll have all your information on a different label, all your ingredients, whatever legally you have to put uh, in the country that you're selling in. So I can do those labels for you as well if you want to, and I'll do them at a very small cost. If you just supply me with the information, tell me what shape label you want or what size label you want, Actually, just the shape because I can work out what size label to go on like if you tell me you want it to fit it just at the top or you want it to fill the whole of the front uh, they'll work it will work it out that way so um, they they're the labels for the back of the boxes and then the front of the boxes as you can see I'm going to be using the round labels I think they look really cute and I think they actually do look cleaner uh, in the white but I'm not going to charge you any extra if you want natural or if you want pink or if you want lemon actually it's called cream but it's definitely lemon uh, that's the pink again so we only have blue blue white natural pink and yellow they're the colors i can do your labels in so it's up to you 
Um, I guess we could take a blue label and pop it on a blue box and see what that looks like. So, for instance, this one. We would just stick that on there. It works pretty well, actually. Um, and that will have, you know, whatever information you need to be on the front of that label. And as you can see... You do get a chance with them. They peel off without stripping any of the pattern, any of the design off the paper box. Something like, say you go for just a plain box, but you might want multiple colours in the plain box. So you can probably have just about any colour because I can colour the, the card just about any colour. I mean, obviously, these are all colours that my printer uses. Um, but if you just wanted to go white, you could put a natural label on the front, a natural label on the back, or pink, or blue, or lemon, or just whatever you want, really. Um, all of that is just going to make your boxes nice and unique. Right. Uh, that's what you're getting in with your price all these gorgeous designs so this one I just made a little cube box I can do cube boxes probably up to 9 by 9 by 9 8 by 8 by 8 is perfect for a round 7 centimeter bath bomb but this box here is I particularly designed that for this cube soap that I made it fits in there perfectly you don't want it to be too tight and you don't want it to be too loose because if it's too light, too tight, when you push the soap in it's probably going to scratch the soap and you don't want that. And if it's too loose it's going to wobble about a lot in, in your box. And I think the tallest box I can do... Well this is the biggest box I can do at the moment is 16 centimeters by 10 centimeters by again it's about three and a quarter centimeters now if that was narrower I could make the depth deeper um, it doesn't really matter about the height there's only a certain it's actually the width on the cutter machine that I'm using but um, I can't go any wider than 30 centimetres, but that has to include your flaps that come out there. So that's about the biggest box we can do, but I mean, look how big that box is compared to a bar of soap. Or compared to this bar of soap. I don't know anybody that's going to have a bar of soap that big. But someone might want to do a set and just do a box like this and put two soaps in, um, which would be a great idea as a selling point. This is another cutout design I had on the front, but it's a little bit intricate, intricate and close up it's not very neat. So I'm thinking for now, I wouldn't recommend a very intricate design on the cutouts. Just something simple. And is much better I did think I wanted a cutout on my boxes but I like them without the cutouts but as I say if you want cutouts there'll be a little bit of an extra charge for that um, and then these I'm just showing you some of the designs we've done we've got a lovely olive peony uh, print there that's a gorgeous pink and green peony, which I did on a a, um, a pearlescent card. Um, but you need all this special card and everything that that will fold without splitting. So there's another design, like a darker design there, of lovely orange peony orange background pink and cream yellow lemon peony design we've got a strong tropical design here 
this little box here I've created for with the um, with the cocoa butter soap in mind again just take it easy you open it you shove your soap on it you put your label on the front your label on the back and away you go of course you can just make your own labels if you want to um, that's a that was the soap the size box for this soap and that's it I think we're about through most of them I mean there's hundreds of different sizes and designs and things I can do so let's go and take a look at the website now and I'll talk you through how that works okay let's pop over to the website then so if you go up to the search bar and you type in edenssecret.co my website will pop up so you'll see a few little changes this is the regular home page at the moment uh, but what's changed is across the top some of the listings have changed so I've called them soap boxes because I think most of these will sell as soap boxes because that's what I'm in the soap making community um, plus I'm thinking there might not be very many listings for soap boxes when you're searching for soap boxes uh, so that's why I've called it soap boxes but we're talking you can use them for soap boxes, bath bomb boxes, body butter boxes, um, massage bar boxes, wax melt boxes, cream jar boxes. You know, the list is endless that we can make. We could make boxes for makeup, eyeshadow, lipstick, concealer, foundation, anything like that. If you make product uh, and you have an idea, what you want your packaging to look like we can do a custom design just for you so let's click on soap boxes and the, this is all i've managed to get up there at the moment um so these are some of the ones i've shown you and as you can see it says the price is zero when you go on etsy it seems like it has a base price of maybe 40 pence and then for however many boxes you buy it adds that price onto the 40 pence so what i've done is have call it 30 pence but give you a discount on that of 30 pence so we're starting at zero so say you wanted the blue and pink peony soap box you would click on that and all the information about the box is here on the left hand side it tells you what the largest boss box i can make is if you're in the uk mainland only i can do free shipping over 150 pounds so if you spend over 150 pounds i will do free shipping just here it says one the soap labels making two so we can organize that between ourselves all you would need to do is just send me a message on my website and ask karen can you come up with some labels for me and i'll tell you how much they are you decide whether you want them or not and uh, we'll just take it from there so this is where the important part is up here and it's a choose quantity of boxes so you can order just one box if you want but one box like one sample is £1.50 which is expensive it's double actually what I'm going to be charging for these boxes but because it's just a sample but I can absolutely assure you if you don't want to spend £1.50 on a box buy a set of boxes so 5 boxes, 10 boxes, 25 boxes the price will pop up the more boxes you buy the cheaper the box becomes per box and we've got that all the way down to uh, might be this one where you're paying 60 pence per box which is a fantastic price for a box of this 
magnitude i have to say i've had a look on etsy and any box similar to this as i say i don't even know the quality or how thick it is or anything it could be a real flimsy box you're talking about one pound thirty one pound fifty for a box like this so i want to make them affordable so that you can buy in small quantities uh for the same price that you would pay if you had to get a big company to create a box for you so obviously when you buy less boxes like 10 boxes it's 11.47 so you're paying one pound 15 almost for, for your box when you get down to 50 boxes it's less than a pound get down to 100 boxes it's a lot less per box it's 72 pence and so on and so on and so on the lowest though i can go for a box price is 60 pence i think and this is just an introductory price at the moment they might go up later because I might find I don't make any money doing this. But I've worked it out and I think I can uh, make a profit at these prices. All right, so if you want to go right down and order 2,000 boxes, you can. Uh, but it'll save a lot of time if you just trust me that these boxes are beautiful and that you're going to be very happy with them in person. Uh, just buy as many boxes as you want if you wanted lots of different styles you can maybe add 10 of those to your order go back to sort boxes you like the look of this box order, I'll order 10 of them now take no notice of what shape the box is in the picture all I'm really showing you here is the print the design that we've got going on there and then what you'll do is you'll add those to your cart and you'll go to checkout and it, there's a list here that says add a note well the video i created just before you saw this this is where you would tell me how big your soap is and it just needs to be straight to the point the height is 12 centimeters the width is 8 centimeters and the depth is 3 centimeters. That's all you need to do, and I'll get that information at checkout. Right, so just go forward, pay for your boxes. As soon as you've paid, um, we'll get those cut and made for you because obviously these are off the shelf designs, but they're custom sizes. Um, I was going to do off the shelf designs, off the shelf sizes, custom designs, custom sizes, custom designs, custom sizes. But I think this will be the easiest way for now. We can work around anything really. So that's it. Um, and just add that to your cart, check out, and off we go. So there's your little video on how to do it. I'm looking forward to seeing those orders flying in from whoever you are. You might not even be part of our soaping community, uh, but I love to see your orders. All right, everyone, thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this um, huge announcement that I've got going on here at Eden Secret. I'll see you all very soon. Bye-bye for now. Okay, so I just forgot to mention, I didn't click on the custom designs box. So this one, uh, you click on there, this is a custom designs, custom sizes, custom soap boxes or, or bath bombs or wax melts, anything, it doesn't matter. I know I've used the word soap boxes, but it doesn't have to be a soap box, it can be a box for anything. Lipstick, lip gloss, eyeshadow. Uh, blusher, uh, wax melts, bath, anything, any, anything at all. So, 
it costs a hundred pound and the reason it's that is it is very time consuming creating these designs to add that I then print onto card then I cut your box now the other good thing is uh, this listing is for me creating a custom design custom size sort box that will only be for you nobody else will get your design ever all you need to do is tell me what kind of patterns you like whether it's floral plain clouds stars mystical natural or your logo or the the letters of your logo um, I will create your design and once you are happy then I will create a custom listing just for you and you can order as many of your custom soap boxes as you wish. Now what I've done is all those boxes that I've done are different sizes uh, but I'm not going to charge you more if you want the big box and I'm not going to charge you less if you want the little box. And the reason being, it's got to be cut from a certain size card anyway. So as long as I can get one box out of one sheet of card, then we're laughing. Um, and the price shouldn't go up or down because it doesn't matter if it is little. Yeah, there'll be a bit of card left over more. There'll be more card left over on a little box than there will be on a big box, but it's still vended useless, that card. Um, I can also do all the labels for you if you want. So again, free shipping over £150 if you're in the UK, UK mainland. I have to say that now because it seems like when we ship up to Scotland, if it goes higher than uh, Edinburgh, or Glasgow, they're calling that out of reach, so they're charging more for that. Northern Ireland's always been classed part of the United Kingdom, but because it's going over the water, shipping's always very expensive, which is wrong. It shouldn't be. It should be the same price because they're part of the United Kingdom. It's always been that way. Republic of Ireland's different because they're independent, um, so again, Republic of Ireland, the shipping's expensive to there. So um, there you go, basically. That's all the information on custom designs, custom sizes. All right, everyone. I hope this video was very informative. I hope you want to buy lots and lots of boxes from Eden Secret and I'll see you all very, very soon. Looking forward to those orders coming in. Bye bye for now.